Hi guys, I'm back again. This is me, Sagar from SG and Creative Creation, and we are going. Uh, we already work on menu um, game uh, level system. So, uh, okay, we will continue this. So, where we leave this so into here? If you follow me, we just made this, and after that, and we made main menu done <clears throat> and if you are new uh, please watch my uh, all tutorial series so then you understand and uh, please subscribe me if you are new so okay so here we just need to when we click this we want to show this and and if you know that if you follow me uh, last video if you follow th part 34 so you know we just um, said this uh, collapsed so it will not show when we play when I click this and when I click uh, there is nothing did you see and uh, when I click this we want to show that show this you know ba mission info <clears throat> for this uh, level so how we gonna do this so first of all we need to change the name if I just quickly change the L1 okay same for L2 level 2 L2 L3 L3 and L4 I don't have L4 but okay for sake of tutorial I give the name I don't have any four to five level so I already have three so <clears throat> so when I click this you know click this button you can click on this so it will give you the button and I already said this info because we just copy this main menu and make this so we get this reference also by default so here we need a one function we just create a one function that set everything for us uh, like this uh, we already you know bind this with quest item quest text we made this quest text uh, in part 34 we made quest text intel text and kill text so we bind with uh, collect quest item with this quest text and intel item text sorry and here uh, fill text we already bind it so what I what we are going to do we made a function okay so how we can make a function so simply uh, take this and take this set uh, set like this and we need one map image so name it map man oh, oh my my mic down map image okay I already name it okay map Mm, map 2d texture okay so I just use 2d texture 2d texture reference so so we can set our map image alt and drag and drop it will set it automatically so what I do is just make a function name um name level info info so into level info we just set it everything set uh, through this so it will automatically make you a variables or make you a you know inputs like this 
so if you want to proper you can name properly quest tag quest item or whatever tags whatever whatever you want this I just change some map image okay so into here we just need to uh, if you remember this I uh, name this container to level I think level info where is that level info level info box this is the level info box so I just name it properly and I make it a variable so because we want this this container info container or info box we want to <coughs> set visibility to show visible whenever we click any button okay so when we click any button it will pops you know mission objectives and image and mission briefing and when you play this uh, if you want you can just name it uh, play button play play button and this is back button so back button back button okay so into here we just quickly use this button and if you remember I made this set it over here and here we need to give the whatever you want to it, uh, complete your map you just put it over here to uh, quest item, collect quest item 2 collect uh, intel maybe 2 for first level and kill 3 and remember this whatever you value put in over here you have to put in all in your level also because if you don't then and you need to select your map image map I have map one image and what is the mean of this why why you set same values I will I will show you for example if you open your map you have to exactly put whatever you put into here two quest item you have to put two quest item on the level somewhere around any any anywhere it's up to you you can put this is the quest item I put it over here and I quest uh, I put one quest item into here secure place and if you want you can just select your AI and uh, into AI detail you can go over here you can select uh, when he die he give me the health you can just select Intel whatever so it, it determined that you have to exactly select what you want in your level so map image you can just simply take snapshot of your map like this when you play you just take a snapshot like like this and crop it and uh, import it like I imported this images like this so I made this simple images here like this so so it will give you a little bit info so I set it over here copy this control C control V control C control V okay same thing level 1 level 2 so here level 2 my level 2 is different so I choose level 2 in uh, map image 2 map image 3 map image 3 and three where is three q here it is so remember this whatever you put you need to set it on your level so i think i'll into second level i don't remember <coughs> oh, so i have one in here i remove uh, a little bit i i change some adjustment one is one is here and one is there one quest item is there so if 
if you want to complete only choosing one so you have to delete one quest item into your level for example if you go over here you in level 2 and this is this is level 2 this is level 2 and you have to uh, quest item collect 2 intel collect maybe 3 not 23 3 and remember this level 2 you can see how much AI in here like here I 3 you can put more AIs or you can give the waypoint over it I leave only 3 3 3 in every every level because I just copy so it's depend on you how how much AI you want to put in your level so you have to you know give the value into here and check your level and put the value so I'll leave everything same but only I just change uh, this so after this into here you can check I have to make one thing and that is a level name okay uh, level name so what I go on going to do is make one level name one variable and this is the name okay just a little bit make some room over here put it over here and throw like this and if you want you just you know take this into on the top like this okay I know you know UI is really a lot of time consuming and uh, it's really you know uh, if you are not pro I like me I'm not pro on UIs and <laughs> so it's um, really you know mess uh, designing stuff and that's uh, you know you suck your head a lot so like this uh, you just need to level remember always remember this don't give a space because uh, when you make a level never uh, you can't give a space maybe you just put uh, you know like this underscore but I just don't give underscore so remember the level exactly and you have to put level name into here not l1 l2 so put level 1 copy this control C and this is the level 2 button so I put level 2 sorry not level 1 level 2 I made this video mm, maybe shorter and I split this into second video so so now you set whenever you click this button you set the level name into here and set everything so what uh, so now into here simply uh, remove from parent okay after that open level this simple throw this level name into here okay very simple copy save and this is the play button if you know this is the play button play mission and you click this you can play this mission and in future we will just you know close unlock uh, unlock this because we need you need to complete this mission then this second level will unlocked we will do that later but right now we have to create everything so uh, into back what you can do is uh, simply click over here and here we have already a game reference instant reference so simply remove or just control C control V okay 
and here we just show main menu show main menu so it will take you back to the main menu okay so <clears throat> if I set everything correctly so we can check it click it oh man sorry I forgot I opened this you know level 2 I think yeah, it's level 2 so just open this main menu click it and play so did you see nothing show when you click oh boom 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 so it will show you two three two but here nothing show pops up i don't know why okay i forget because i i, I can't bind this so you just need to bind this bind this image bind this image with map 2d texture which we create here 2d maps texture and we set it over here map 1 map 2 okay so when we play click a button doom did you see it change and it changed the values also did you see two now three so now for uh, not right now this will not work because I don't I don't have any and I don't put any code in here so you understand so if you have more levels you just copy this and paste this and put the image and everything so we need to check this you know open level also so when I click this so we need to play this button button to play this map so it's a mission briefing a little bit you can put different kind of briefing briefing how you can put a different kind of briefing it's very simple so you just copy no, sorry copy not copy you can bind and make a texture if you want to different kind. I don't may made this but uh, I give you one tip if you want to brief every mission so what you can do is just make uh, this same 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 type same type of texture control you can du duplicate and make name it change the name uh, uh, mission brief and same you can just put everything into like this for example you put whatever your mission type this like this whatever so so same thing you need to bind this text bind with that text and when you click on the map the you know brief message will be changed okay different map different briefing you can tell what type of uh, level and what type of AI what you do in your maps blah 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 okay so when I click okay level one we need we want to play so it will take you into the level okay so right now we don't set any code and we leave it from here and we will continue into next video so thank you guys hope you like it um, I don't want to make this video big the people will bore so just need to quit over here and we will continue this so thank you guys please like my videos and subscribe my channel if you are new and please join my every page also thank you we will continue this in the next part bye bye